Hello, and welcome to Blood on the Clock Tower. This is the 9 p.m. game, which is starting at 9.25, or uh, 8.25 if you live in Central Time, which some of us do. But anyway, this is the Crazy Saturday Night Homebrew script, the second Crazy Homebrew script, so we already played Implying today. And I did get to take a nap, so you'll notice I'm not super cranky like I was that one game. <laughs> uh, I'm also good again, which helps. Uh, and the theme to my background is uh, a minion, which is called Two-Face or something. I'll show you the rules. Do -do. Uh, the Provocator. Each night choose two players. The first player must be mad about executing the second player, or they may be executed. You lose this ability if there are four or fewer, fewer players alive. So, this script is the Murder Masquerade, which I understand is craziness, uh, and I've really not spent a lot of time looking at it, but I did read over the demons about a week ago, and so it'll point out that one of the demons uh, benefits from people claiming their roles. So you got each knight choose a player, they die. You may instead choose up to three players and roll combinations. Any correct combinations die. So if we claim our rolls, then we might die quickly. Uh, the second demon, the Xanatos. The first knight, you may look at the grimoire. Each knight, you look, you may look at the grimoire, then choose a player, they die. So if they're in play, then they know all of our rolls, which is ironic because it's like we're going to be not telling our rolls which will only benefit evil if that's the demon in play, because they actually will know everything. And then we got the, I don't know, tarantula. Each knight choose a player. And an outsider roll, that player dies. And if they were that roll, uh, then the tarantula gets stacked again, plus one outsider. So if that's the case, then there would be an outsider. So they are not going to claim that they're an outsider. If they are an outsider, because that is definitely the demon that's in play. If they are in play. Which, ironically, it would be super helpful to know if there's two kills and then one of them claims to be. Yeah, I guess that works. Uh, and then the last one. Each knight. Choose a player, they die. Then if no one was executed yesterday, you may choose a player who was nominated and they die. So there's going to be quite a few. There's only one demon that doesn't get multiple kills. And the Provocator. There's two minions in this setup. Oh, the Sorceress would be a minion reason for two deaths. And they could do that multiple times. So they could keep us thinking that it's one of the other demons. The only way you can get three kills if it's the Asmodeus. I always suspected Asmodeus was a demon. The Hecatome. If you are executed, the demon may act an additional time tonight. Interesting. Anyway, I see that there's a coronavirus here, the Blighted. So that's interesting. Alright. Uh... I guess that's enough for now, and I'll try to actually record the... Oop. Welcome back, everyone. This is the first day of Murder Masquerade. It's six minutes to whisper. Starting now. Not everyone at once. <laughs> Hmm. All right, Jen, let's talk. I don't believe there's a provocateur in place. Even? Are you? Yep, my place. Cool. Uh, 
So Jen and Steve. Who were gold the first night? I don't okay. know, but they would have. They would have. Whisper is now open for six so, minutes, restarting yeah, the timer now. I'm gonna meta that there's no provocateur because I would have been tough. Steve. Alright. How's it going? You just want a hard claim? Um sure. Really? I hmm. I could. You do realize that one of the demons can kill you if you if they know your role. Actually an a minion can also. That's true. I did rush through and read all of this. I can see where not saying would benefit, but I could also see that being very powerful for us to, as good townspeople. One of the demons gets to see the grimoire every night, so if that's the demon, then we definitely should all be hard claiming, because otherwise we're just, like, allowing evil to know everything. I think that's what they were just talking about in the room, is that they don't think it was, because they could act night zero? Is that right? Uh... The first night you may look at the grimoire. However, I will say that that uh, Nam may have just sent them a screenshot. Yeah, and then so also, the time was very they quick. They don't they so they see the grim grimoire, but they don't actually make a choice. Night zero. So yeah. Okay, so it is it is beneficial um, for that case, but it's not for other cases. Yep. Uh, I'm good with which, whichever you decide. Well, I uh, I like throwing caution to the wind, so let's just tell each other's rules. Okay. I'm clerk. I'm the undertaker. Interesting. Interesting. Clerk. What does the clerk do? Um. So I actually get a uh, roll each night uh, by townsfolk. Hmm. That's helpful. All right, I'm not going to hard claim again, but uh, hopefully I you're not lying to me. Think, yeah, I don't think it would be beneficial uh, for me to hard claim either uh, beyond one or two people. Um, and I think I'm going to keep it to one. This, yep. just, just well, especially out. due to the nature of the script. Yeah. If I can find one of my other, you know, uh, roles. What name were you given? given? Do you get a name on Night Zero? I do get a name on Night Zero. I'm going to wait just to see... Uh, if it comes out, okay. just because I want to see if I'm poisoned in any way. I couldn't find anything that may be able to I don't know that it'll come out, though, because of the way this... I mean, like, until the final three. Yeah, and I also, I could be... Is there any manipulation? There is manipulation. There is a drunk. Like, could be a drunk, too. We, either of us could be a drunk. Um, so, it's just kind of... Uh, it, it, it will become beneficial around, uh, around three for me to definitely give some information to at least you, if not more. That's sounds good. My thoughts. All right. Look at that. That, that yeah. come on now. Come on. <laughs> um you're showing everybody how handsome you are. Um <laughs> <you're>, yeah. <laughs> what? You don't want to talk uh. fine. Complainer. Ooh. Anyway, yeah, you could just feel his spine. So he did the right thing. He was like, Mom, there, I heard about them saying. All right, and, who's up know. next? Oh. All right, well, Michael, let's go. Hey, buddy. Like, nobody's talking. Michael? Anybody? Oh, Steven. Okay, yeah. sure. Two of yours, you're the very bottom. I'm afraid yeah. everyone. Least important player. Michael had long hair until today. Mike. How are you, sir? Doing pretty good. Yeah, not much whispering is going to be happening, I don't think. 
they're scared of the Xenatos. Yeah, I'm gonna do a three for three. Sure. I'm gonna give three rolls that I'm not. Okay, me too. I am not the Blighted, or the Lush, or the Berserker. Okay. I am... I, I don't actually care. <laughs> if you want yeah. to tell me stuff, so go ahead. Yeah, 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 yeah. I'm not the Sorcerer, Provocateur, or the Chemist. Okay. <laughs> For what that's worth. So, uh, have you read the script? Yes, I have. So obviously, I read it ahead of time. there is a demon and a minion that benefits from knowing people's roles, which is obviously going to uh, significantly impact the game. Yes, correct. I will um, also point out the I I irony that there is a demon that sees the grimoire every night, and if that's in the play, it, then we're only benefiting uh, evil by not sharing evil. our roles. Yeah, yeah. The only way we're going to know that is after night one, I guess. Um, no, I don't think we'll ever know, because there are multiple reasons that there could be multiple kills. I think mm. the only reason that we would have, well, I don't even think that necessarily validates, is Asmodeus can kill three. Uh, yeah. However, like, potentially one of the ones that could kill two could go off, and one of the, the, the minions that kills. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I saw that one as well. Um, yeah, I just don't like... All of all of a sudden, all the chit chats happening now. Are they all of a sudden happening? Yeah. Well, I think that they should be happening, so I'm not bothered by that. I think it's silly for people to say we're not going to chat. Like you're not really playing the game, then. True. That is true. Um, I got a bit of sus on a, on two people already. Good. Let's um, kill one. But of them. I don't want to. Yeah. Well. Just tell actually, me one was... of them, and I'll nominate them, dude. I always nominate. Just tell me one of them. Uh, I got sus on Jason just from what he said before. Oh my goodness, give me a different name. I don't want to be sus on Jason. <laughs> uh, Sarah is another one. Oh my goodness, you're terrible. There's a lot of us that haven't really talked. Huh? Yeah. That's Welcome crazy. back, everyone. Nomination is now open. Oh, there's only four of us. Okay. Closing I feel the like... day in six minutes. Starting I feel like we should nominate Jeremy. I feel like we should execute him. Okay, that's two different things. You said nominate, okay. and then you said execute. I feel like I feel like we should execute Jeremy. Did, did, okay. Wait, did you chat with him? No, I didn't. I I am not a good execution. No. I still feel like we should. Yeah, I think that we should probably kill Jeremy. Hmm. Why? From what, from what I ch said from from our chat, I don't. Sorry. I did not chat with Michael or Stephen. So, yeah. Who did you talk to, Michael? Uh, literally, Stephen. That's it. Come on. Yep, that's Come what on. I got. My mm -hmm. information points to Jeremy. <laughs> that's <laughs> not true. Which one, of, which one of you thinks Jeremy should be executed? And not I feel like that? Jeremy should be executed. Yeah, I do too. I feel like Jeremy should be executed too, then. Jen did. Uh, oh, 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 yeah, yeah. Oh, so we do have a provocateur. Mm. Yeah. Oh. No comment. Okay. I still feel like Jeremy should be executed. Yeah, I'm not. A, I'm not a good kill, guys. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna shut up now because I've made my case. Sure. That's a provocateur. Uh, I will okay. talk more tomorrow. Yep. Um, I nominate Sarah. Michael has been executed, and the game continue. Well, now we know for sure it's provocateur. Wow. Hey. Well, that doesn't make sense. He needed to nominate him. He needed to actually nominate him to show that he meant it. Oh, oh my God. Are you kidding? It says... You have to be wow. mad about... He said he made his execute. case. Uh, you weren't mad enough. <laughs> you didn't get to decide <laughs> Right. Like, as soon as Candace said whether well, it's provocateur, everything we did, but at least we know. Wait, please go sleep, please. Oh my god. Okay. Uh, I got more to say tomorrow. Anyway, the game has started quite poorly.
I have a guava. I do not know how to eat it. Yeah. Anyway, there's no important news. Do not like guava. Ugh. Hey, what up? You missed Matt. That's wonderful. That to execute at lane. That is wonderful. Okay. Good luck, Steven. Do I not get information about but because of my role? Later, it's not your turn. Oh, well, excuse me. Yes. You learn Reamer. Oh, that sucks. Thanks. Okay, bye. <clears throat> oh, I just okay. got the response. Only Europeans can't come to the US, but US people can go to Europe. I guess it's a anyway. one Welcome back, everyone. This is the second day of murder masquerade. Last night, Candice died, and the game continue. I'm yeah. just going to say, I'm just going to say that um, I was provocateur yes, six yesterday. <laughs> yeah, but I didn't make my case strong enough. So if you are today, make sure you nominate the person. Yep, we know that. We figured that much out. I'm pretty Got sure it. we got somebody to see the grimoire. Michael, I'd like to talk and, to you. And um, I was the dreamer, and I only have one night's info. Yeah. And yeah, mm. I'm Michael, not going to share it until whichever one is going to be Tanner. Event. Michael, it's not actually not neither one yes, of those. I need to talk to you, Jeremy. Right. Can we talk? Mm -hmm. Did you uh, get it out with that one? But you got it wrong. You. you might need to use one. Never give your role in a script where there's an Undertaker. Uh, yes, I'm just shitty that, like, I died because I didn't nominate, even though it says you need to be mad about executing. I... Which he, 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 he clarified to me that I didn't make my case strong enough. I am the Undertaker, and I would have appreciated the opportunity to confirm myself. Sorry. Sorry. My bad. So anyway, um, I was told that you were the dreamer. So what is, are you, you said you weren't going to share your information. Will you share it with me since I... Yeah, 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 I'll share it with you. Um, I picked Sarah the first, like, night zero. Okay. And I got Bloodhound and the demon, um, the Tushigumo or whatever it's called, however you say it. Okay. Yeah, I'm going to try to chat to her and see whether uh, the reason why I came out as the dreamer was because I wanted people to come and hard claim to see what Sarah would say. Oh, okay. Well, does that like I wasn't thinking about the Undertaker being in play? I apologize. That's okay. All right. All right. Kwame. Kwame. Um, um, do you want to talk, Michael? Sure, Jeremy. I'll just, yeah, I'll jump to your room quick. All right. Steven, do you want to talk? Sure. Okay. For some reason, I just read that Lynn, Lynn, Chris, and um, Elijah. Oh, is Elijah not playing? Is... He's a spectator, and he should have okay. his camera off. I was reading him as evil the way he was sitting there in the room and not saying anything. I was reading him as totally evil. Never mind. <laughs> yeah, he's not evil. I mean, he might be evil, but he's not playing. <laughs> I'm assuming you're the one that Michael checked. No. 
Oh, okay. I was going to say, hopefully you're clear. Too. Um, anyway, I don't know if it's good to claim a role or not claim a role. It's not good to claim a role. Then, then I don't really want to say much. other than Well, I know. That's what I was wondering is what we were even going to talk about. Well, I thought you were the one who was cleared by Michael, and then I was going to say, okay, I trust you. And well, I should have told but, you I was cleared by Michael then. Anyway, I guess let's go. We're done already. Okay. Okay. There's nothing else to say. I do think you're right about Lynn, though. Because she started saying something about bottom half when I walked in, and it was really yeah. weird. Okay. Yep. Bye. Is Jen just talking to everyone? Jen does this every game and it makes him look so evil because he's trying to push for info. All right, well, I mean, it's, it's your turn. For We're going to chat in Michael's room. In Michael's room? Michael, no. can I speak with you? Why? No, that's dumb. Let's, let's chat I, in my room. Michael, can I speak with you? All right. <laughs> You're funny, Stephen. Yes, Jason, you can. <laughs> I hate the spelling of a Yahoo with an S T E V E N. Here, I'll, I'll fix it. <laughs> uh, so, what's up? Um, I am the Hecatome. Okay. Uh, it would be much more helpful if you told me your demon. I believe that the demon is Lynn. Uh, and you, you have bluffs yet? I haven't spoken to her yet. All right then. I don't even know what to make of you. I don't know what to make you. I don't know what to make you. I assume you're bluffing. No. I'm the Hecatome. I love being these kinds of roles because you can't execute me. We could. You can. Oh my god. Why would you come out as a... Uh... Go ahead, kill me. Is that all you wanted to tell me? I will confirm myself to you by getting two kills. Oh my god. Um, in my semi -truck. Oh, you're bottom. Uh, maybe we'll continue that tomorrow, Jen. Yeah, yeah. Welcome back, everyone. Everybody. Right. Nomination is now open. Closing the day in six minutes. Um, can I nominate Elijah because he's been super quiet and just sitting there? Ooh. You're going to nominate a spectator? <laughs> I'm joking. I, I figured that out halfway through. I told Stephen, I'm in the room. I'm like, Elijah's been really quiet and sitting there. Um, I don't, I suspect him. Yeah, he quiet. said he thinks you're evil. And I said, I don't think he's evil. I said, well, actually, he might be evil, but he's not playing. <laughs> I, uh, really that I, saw your video. I kept watching you. Him, That's like, evil from Jason. That's suspicious from Jason. <laughs> we are no, spectators. You definitely are evil. Elijah, can that you shut joke. your camera off? If that was a joke. It was just, I was really confused. Um, <laughs> a few people, a few people have lost their seats as well. Oh, uh, not me. I haven't. Uh, oh, no, I'm good. Anyway. Um, uh, yeah, so if, if we all think Elijah's evil, then he's probably the good twin. Uh, <laughs> okay, yeah, right. Well, I want to have, I want to do my little announcement. Okay. So I'm, I'm dead. Um, what is yours, Candice? Thank you. Um, I wasn't in my seat because after I got killed, they never put my body back, so I had to sit back in the seat. Yeah, well, it's best to uh, take yourself out of the seat. That way you don't accidentally dead vote. Yeah, because, yeah, you know, I'm, I forget I'm dead uh, all the time. So my plan was not to talk to anybody the first day and not do anything the first day in the event 
that we had a chemist who does not have to know what anyone in particular's role is. They just pick something. And given the fact that we normally do a virgin type thing on day one, I assumed that I was poisoned if we had a chemist. So I wasn't going to do anything day one, but I was the center. So getting me out keeps me from confirming myself and somebody else too. Now I understand why you you think uh, that the demon is or the minion because isn't there two things that? Uh, is it two things that can see the room or one? I know the Xanatos, hey, that is but... super interesting because if we have the uh, the demon that gets to see the grimoire and the minion that gets to kill if they know rolls, that's a little unfair. I have some yeah, that's two. I have some info. Too. I'm gonna just out it because um, I'm pretty useless at this point regardless. I'm the Almoner, um, and I can tell you for sure that there's an outsider in the game. Mm-hmm. So um, because of that... We haven't um, gotten the Xanatos. Because of that, um, it's not the Xanatos because there is an yeah. outsider in the game. So I'm just making it clear I'm the Almoner. I basically got information. I'm not going to say what outsider is but there's at least an outsider in the game i'm not gonna say what it well is. we don't need to kill you in case you get told something else tonight too all right yeah. well anyway I, i'm not gonna say anything else i've been watching for social reads and uh i i'm pretty sure that lynn is evil so i nominate lynn i don't think you realize steven? that i'm not evil I mean, lynn steven staircase it's mostly social uh terrible but I've 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 been talking to a couple of people and a couple of people have agreed that they well they literally said it before I said it and uh, so I don't know that seems to be an intersection of uh, suspicion. Okay. Think, so unless you think Jen's my demon, okay, but whatever. I've literally only talked to Jen. And I talked to Chris, and then Jason came in and heard me claim bottom half in Town Square. I don't think you know. I think you're evil, and this is a play on your part. Not evil. This is a terrible kill. Um, it doesn't necessarily mean he's yeah, evil. I was going to say, Lynn. The vote. Terrible yeah, kill. Lynn. He has no social read on me. Lynn, 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 remember what we talked I, about last I, round. I, I, yeah. trust, I trust his social read. I trust your social read, Stephen. No, Jason's evil, I, too. I trust his social read, Lynn. I, think that he's I don't Lynn, trust his social read. I'm not evil. Lynn, ha- Lynn, how did I die yesterday? I trust his social read, Lynn. I think that you're evil because Stephen's saying you're evil. I trust that Stephen's right. Evil right. is not it, enough. It be provocative. Correct. Is there any other nominations? Oh, yeah. 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 yeah, oh, yeah, yeah everyone yeah. forgot about that. Yeah. Oh, geez. Okay. So don't get angry at Stephen. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> not yet. Not yet. <laughs> now, to be fair, <laughs> that was serious. That could be a play too, but I that is true. Don't it could it be is. a play, but I don't think it is. We cannot sleep on the fact that he said intersection of suspicion <laughs> in his <laughs> accusation. We <laughs> need to take a moment, play? and we need to adopt that. <laughs> Move it forward. That's, that's production that value epic. of, of like videos. It. That was epic. I'd like, I like, I'd like it. to nominate. I'd like to nominate Guami. Jason, nominate Guami. Jason, stir case. So, I haven't talked to Guami. Stephen has to talk to Guami, but I think Guami should definitely be executed, and I'm super suspicious of him. And Guami raised his hand when me and Stephen did. Me and Stephen had reason to be suspicious of Lynn, but Guami didn't. But Guami raised his hand as a third hand. So, I'm very, very suspicious of Guami. Like, I think Guami should be executed, and I'm super suspicious of him. Guami, your defense? Nope, I'm a good player. (laughs) <laughs> and I always vote, so if that makes me suspicious, because I do the same thing every game. <laughs> this really sucks, because now it really sucks with the provocateur. I don't vote. know which one I'm actually Guami. I think we should get some more votes. I think we should get more hands. I'm not that suspicious of him, to be honest. I'm a little suspicious. Yeah, we should get at least one more. Jeremy, I'm a little suspicious, not a lot. There All right, I'll, I'll put them on. But that's but that's oh. enough suspicious. Hey, enough. I think Jason's on the vote is enough. There's some is in the shopping block. <laughs> Time is up, so I'm closing a day in 30 seconds, unless there is any other nomination. Um, How does everybody feel about Chris A? Who? Just, he seems to be a nice guy. 
Oh, Chris A. <laughs> what I know of. <laughs> Seems like he might be a detective of some kind. Typically, <laughs> when we introduce the players, the, the, oh, and Chris A. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. Um, yeah. <laughs> and can I, I know, start I nominate Steven. Okay. Wami, nominate Steven. Wami, story case. Uh, we had a very strange conversation. <laughs> I'm going to have a follow-up question uh, here. I, I do not like what you said. Steven, your defense. Uh, so I have a question for you, Guami. Have we ever had a conversation that wasn't weird and you liked what I said? <laughs> Afraid not. <laughs> okay. I rest my case. <laughs> oh, yeah, very, very, very early on in maybe. <laughs> before, before we knew each other. <laughs> Yeah. Are you involved on Steven? We need, we need five on this. <laughs> we, we actually may want if we if we no. think, if we think Guami is evil, he's probably the hedicomb, which means the demon's gonna act twice tonight. I don't think that's possible. Yep, I'm the hedicomb. <laughs> but if that's if that's the case, not if enough, that's the case, Steven, Steven is it, for a day. Is yeah, there any other know. nomination? I'm closing a day in thirty seconds. If that's the case, Steven's double claiming my role. <laughs> because he claimed Hedicomb to me. <laughs> <laughs> whatever it whatever it is. <laughs> I love how we can't say stuff. <laughs> there is a tarantula um, in the script. Can can I ask a favor? Like I know I'm not I confirmed hundred percent, but can people come and talk to me about their roles, please? Yeah, I'll talk to you, Michael. That's, yep, I'll talk that, to you. Guami, yep. you in the chopping block. You executed. How is your life to die? Um, how about a cannon? Locked in your hecatomb. <laughs> Guami, <laughs> in the middle of the uh, masquerade dance hall, like, you know, they are playing very romantic and slow music. <laughs> Guami just run outside to the patio and launch himself into the cannon and launch himself out of the hall. And he hit the wall die very brutally. Wami is executed and die. In the game, continue. So my theory was that we wanted to get an execution in every day. However, uh, probably want to wait one because our number is going to be well if the demon kills multiple so far it's only killed one of course nobody's claimed rules player and role so they wouldn't want to do that unless they knew multiple people's roles if i told one person it's relatively safe however if I tell multiple people, if one of those people is evil, then they can get all of their information back to the... So, that's risky. I'm not the drunk. Because I learned... Michael was the dreamer. I suppose he could have t told me the correct information to make me think I'm not the drunk. I think it's likely that we had the Xanatos. If that's the case, then we really don't need to be careful of our rules. So that's what I think is the case. That's the only one where we wouldn't have multiple kills unless we also have... Well, we know we have the Provocator. The sorcerer wouldn't want to use their ability unless they were sure, because otherwise they die. Interesting. So, Steven? Yes. You met Matt to execute Jeremy. Crap. You got that? Unfortunately, yes.
Yo, what up? Did you learn Hecaton? Really? That's what you learn. Okay. Bye. Wonderful. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. Last night, Sarah died. And the game continue. You have five minutes to whisper. Sarah, Sarah now. can I please talk to you? Yeah, Michael, we can talk. Okay. Um, I'll go to your one. All right, Candace, I'll talk to you. Okay. I will grace you with my presence. Okay. I woke up this morning to stare at my friends. I looked around and I was dead again. I'm coming to your place. All right. I'm a little confused. A little? Oh, you're definitely evil. If you're not a lot confused, I don't know who you are. <laughs> <laughs> well, only one person died last night. Uh, I don't think it's a shamble off. Uh, well, I was told that Guami was the Hecatome. The Hecatome. Who told you that he was the Hecatome? Nam. Nam told you that he was the Hecatome. Yes, I'm the Undertaker. Uh, then you're poisoned. Um, well, it could be. We might have a chemist. That is a possibility. Yeah, who just picked Undertaker because they didn't want to clear him. Probably. So, uh, I don't know. well, that is so. That is the po that's the thing. Is at this point we know that it is either the provocateur and the hecatome, or the provocator and the chemist, because the only way I could become poisoned the is the chemist. chemist. The chemist, probably. You think it's the chemist? Uh, it's probably the chemist. What's your read on Jan since you talked to him first? Uh, well, I thought he was good, but I don't, I don't actually know anything. So what demon do you think we have? Did somebody say there is an outsider? Well, there is an outsider. How do we know that? Because there's an outsider. That's such a not answer. It's a huge answer. No, you um, basically... So we have an almoner. In hey, you want to put your microphone down so I can hear you? Oh, that might work. Yeah, that's um, so good. Yeah, that, might, that just <laughs> might work, you know. Oh, maybe nobody heard my song. You didn't hear my song before I came to, to chat. I heard something that sounded pretty unpleasant. Was that a song? It was a song. It was my little country song. I was like, I, I just showed up today to stare at my friends. I woke up this morning dead again. Um, yeah, it was, it was going to be a hit. Uh, um, so we have somebody that claimed to be the almoner but prior to that I had some social reads on someone and um, did some more research into that and uh, that research checked out so you've been researching the almoner no no I don't research Jason um, Jason's Jason, the almoner Jason said he was the almoner. Yes. Okay. Which I don't, I don't know if that's true or not. He might be sharing somebody else's information, which he often swaps roles with people. But um, I knew outside of him saying that that there was an outsider. I, right. yeah. So. Yep. So it's highly likely that the provoc uh that a, he a hecatome is in place or we have a well if the hecatome is in place then it was guami because we definitely have a provocateur so if there's not a uh um, unless a chemist then it's the provocateur and the hecatome and if that's the case then it has to be guami because i was told that he was the hecatome Next. However, we didn't um, get an extra kill. Yeah, this, so that's what I'm saying. Something's not right. Well, they could have sunk the extra kill to keep us confused, but that seems like a waste. However, that would give us an outsider, and they don't know that there is an undertaker, and they might choose to use that to make us think it's the Tujugu be the tarantula. Sushi Gumo. 
<laughs> Sushi beat the ranch. <laughs> gotcha. All right. Well, um, it's possible it's a master play, but I have not seen enough conversation between. I know Guami talked to you, but who else did he talk to? He hasn't really talked to anybody else. I'm Max. All right. I think I'm going to head out. I have another conversation yeah. I'd like to have. Yeah. So I don't have much to offer. I've been dead for eight days. So that's an exaggeration. I mean, you know, you know my information. I'm not giving you what bowl, what bowl or bowls I saw. Yep. Let's, let's um, do it. Yeah, sounds good. He's got to go I mean, give you all my top secret information. Yep. Hello? Hello. There he is. Oh, my goodness. Hey. You made it in just in time. The room's just yeah, closed. Just so, in time. Uh, you didn't want to give me your information right away. You now have three days yep. of information. Are you zero, zero sinner, one dreamer, two undertaker. That's super weak. That's what it is. That's, well, what that's like literally so the information that I already had. Well, <laughs> there's not much I can do about that. That's uh, I will. Oh. Thank you. Welcome um, back, everyone. This is another day of murder mastery. Michael, uh, it makes me really hard to talk to you when you're in uh, a conversation the whole day with what sorry. nomination is sorry. open. Um, Closing it in five I'd minutes. Like right now. Chris. I think Chris should be executed. Jason, um, nominate Chris. I'd like to nominate Jason, Chris. story case. Um, I think Chris should be executed. I'd like to nominate him. And uh at some point, we have to get evil players. I think Chris could be evil. I don't know what else to say. I, you know, my role doesn't say what Chris is, so my role doesn't actually help me. But I think Chris is evil. I think we should tell him because I'm trying to eliminate who's not evil in the game. So I, Chris? I uh, I'm Townsfolk. I'm, but I'm half. Um, don't want to say much more than that at the moment, just in case we got certain evil roles. Uh, uh, I don't want to die. Turning your boat on Chris A. Lynn, you have to take your seat as well. Oh, yeah. Everyone here to take a seat, Lynn. Okay, starting your boat on Chris A. Lynn, do you want to die? No. Um, did the almoner get visited again? I, I'm done with information. I know everything. I know how many outsiders Your are. Your vote is not call. enough. Or how many? A is, I know, I know a. is there any other nomination? Yeah, I'm going to nominate Jeremy. Steven, nominate Jeremy. Steven, spare case. Well, I have uh, quite a few people filled out, um, and I know that the stuff I have filled out is right. Jeremy is not filled out, so it feels like a particularly good kill to me. Jeremy, the defense. Um, I am a it happen. I am a particularly bad kill, probably. Um, I, I am an outsider. I will claim that. But I don't think I want to say which one, just in case there's a. Well, don't say anything. Just don't say I, anything I know else. You are. I right. confirmed him, by the way, for those who want to know. Uh, yeah, I figured that, but I didn't. I just need to know if you were visited again. So that would tell us if we have a certain minion in there. Starting the vote from Jeremy. Because that would make its difference as what we need to do right now. All right, we need to get two more votes. Okay. Well, if you wouldn't have killed me, I would have voted. Well, you can still vote. Wait, <laughs> you got one left. Okay, so I don't understand. If, if Jason is, like, this doesn't make any sense. Your vote is Jason not is enough. Confirming is for for like the is there any other nomination? Then, then okay, we need to kill him. 
it, it's, it's out. You need to kill him. And I'm I'm good. So like that means the other three are evil because we certainly haven't killed off an evil player yet. I think only two of them are evil. I think we I think Guami is evil. So Lynn, I think Steven or Jen are the best kills, but I don't know which one's better. I think Jason is good. I'm a little worried I'm being played by him. But I think he's good. Is there any role that All right, let's kill like Jen. From you? Uh, I nominate Jason. Jen, nominate Jason. Jen, third face. I don't know. Something seems off to me with Jason trying to confirm so many different people, and we know that there's got to be at least two people here that are evil. I don't know. I just, it feels off to me. Jason? Um, I haven't confirmed so many people. I confirmed one person because my role tells me outside of the deck outside of the play, and I talked to Jeremy, who on turn one said, I don't believe that there's a, uh, hang on, I gotta look what it's called. I don't believe there's a Vanthos in play. And then with my information, I went and talked to Jeremy and said, I'm the Elmoner. Are you this? And he said, yes, I'm this. And that's the way our conversation went. And that's, so I'm not confirming anyone else but Jeremy. I'm confirming that Jeremy is an outsider. Can the Grim, is there a demon that could see the Grim? Yes. Yeah. Yes, but yeah. that's, there would be no outsiders in that case. Yeah, yeah, true. So the Gary, one demon that we know for us effect can't be. Gary right. is not confirming that I'm not the demon that sees Grim either, if that's the case. But that's all I'm confirming is Jeremy is an outsider, 100%. Um, Can you vote on Jason? I don't think there's any reason to kill him. Uh, um, the, only, the only issue I have is he would... Yeah, I don't want to say... Yeah, there's really not a way that... No, because the only way that Jason can be evil... And, wrote, if if he was the demon that sort of, that sort of grim, he takes away Jeremy outside. would have to be evil as well. And Jeremy... Right. Yeah. Uh, Steven, you raise your hand, so... Go yeah, ahead. so it's pretty okay. clear to me that the evil team is Guami, oh, Jeremy, and Jen. So I think somebody should nominate Jen at this point. Yes, so I time is up. Yeah. So Sounds good. How is time up? No, he said 30 seconds. So you have time to nominate time Jen. Six, six minutes. It was six minutes every day. Okay. Time is up, so I'm closing it in 30 I'll seconds. Nominate I'll, nominate Who? I'll nominate Jen. Chris I already a, said it, Jen. but it's fine. Chris A, <laughs> it's very okay. Um, pretty sure that one of the other people are evil. So oh, Jen's probably the evil one. Jen, your defense. Um, I, I'm fine with this. Uh, I don't think it's, uh, the best kill because we should be aiming for the demon. Um, I was the clerk and the, one of the people, I think the demon is Jason, honestly. Uh, he's one of the people that I did not get, uh, information as to being a role in the game. Um, and just seems extremely suspect that if we think Jeremy is evil, that Jason is cool with clearing him. Um, I don't know. Uh, but if that's what we need to do, let's go for it. Uh, so I'll talk just to you tomorrow, Jen. Some I'll pertinent to information. Tomorrow. Jen did claim clerk to me, and he claimed roles that I know are in the game. I don't know if other people have claimed to Jen. Jen, I'll I'll talk to you tomorrow. During a vote on Jen. Oh, this is way too many hands, guys. Well, Jen is definitely going to pull his hand, so don't worry about that. Yeah, I'm not worried about Jens. I'm worried about the rest of you. I'm worried about you. Uh, it could be that, that uh, Jen is being each other's block. That, is there any other nomination? Minion that kills closing the rain minion minion second? The makeup artist. Why is Nam always interrupting? <laughs> the makeup artist. Uh, that was fun. Uh, Jeremy nominates Steven. Jeremy nominates Steven. Jeremy, sir, okay. Um, I don't know anything about Steven or Lynn. I'm a little confused about Jason. I actually trust Jen's information and I'm pretty sure I trust Chris A's information. So that leaves Steven and Lynn for me. Did Social say, read, Steven seems more evil to me. Did you say you were confused about Jason? Steven? I, I don't know if Jason's playing me or not. It's possible that he's evil. All right. 
well, this is a script where literally you shouldn't claim to people, so I didn't claim to you. Uh, I do suspect that you're evil, and I nominated you, so it's only fitting that you would re-nominate me. Did you not? Oh, yeah, I forgot you nom. I honestly forgot you nominated me, Steven. <laughs> well, makes sense. Checks out. Sorry, you vote, I'm Steven. <laughs> I think what we did is good already. And I think we lost when we didn't get rid of Jason, but... That's possible. Um, you didn't yeah, I think so, too. You didn't lose. Oh, you he could be the enough. demon that Steven, sees the grimoire. Is I, the only way that Jason can be that is if, or, if Jeremy's or evil as well. There is no way I could be the demon that sees the, the grimoire if Jeremy is an outsider. But keep saying I'm the demon that sees the grimoire. Yeah, Literally, yeah. that... It's just proven by Jeremy being an outsider. No, but. it's proven that, you, that that Nam makes tons of mistakes. <laughs> Unless Nam screwed up the count, there is no way I could be the demon that seeks Grimoire and Jeremy being an outsider. I think we missed on Steven, guys. I'm going for the almighty kicked out of the game. <laughs> have to put in an epic achievement unlocked when that happens. <laughs> that time is up. Jane, you're in chubby block. You're executed. How would you like to die? Uh, I don't care. Whichever way. So, Jen. Dealer's uh, choice. <laughs> die of a broken heart because, you know, when he was dancing in the hall, no one asked him to dance. Damn it. <laughs> That's a very brutal way to die. Die a heart break. Jen is in the chopping block. It's excuse and die. That mosquito was coming to ask and you to dance. And I have to it. ask the label to correct my mistake. Dio ex fiasco because I have, I have to admit that I have. Oh, oh please, please don't tell account. me I guessed right. Yeah, oh, <laughs> I have my. the answer wrong. Oh, anyway, congratulations, what? we all go to. You didn't get no, right, congratulations. The good team, you have won the game. You executed the demon. Okay. Darn it though, uh, I wanted to let's do start my sleuth. With the I... roll call first. I wanted to Thanks. do my sleuth. Let's start with my. Oh, I do your. Oh, you're the sleuth. I was bluffing with the other thing so I could do it at the end. But there's less players left, but it's all good. You'll hear. Do you want to do a sleuth? I wanted to be a super slayer and get on the leaderboard for being yeah, able sure. to get try, your own I don't think you get it anyway. Uh, do it now, do it. Uh, Jason. Do it before yeah. I reveal. It didn't matter, game. Jason. You would have died next round anyways. Get into, get into Sukuyuki, and I don't know who would have been. No, nope, you're wrong. Okay, good try. Wrong. Oh, wait, we we can. We're gonna stop Jason sleuthing now because he's wrong in the first game. Yeah, terrible sleuth. <laughs> All right. Okay. I had you written as sleuth. Let's start with your roll call. Steven is your first town folks, the Undertaker. Hulon Michael is the Rimmer, sober information. And Guani as a hit pick katan was also sober information. Uh, he was made mad on uh, the second night and today. And the target was Lynn and Jeremy accordingly. Michael was your reamer who got on the information before getting executed uh, by the provocateur. Uh, he checked Sarah and got a uh, bloodhound and the, the Suchibumo, the, one of the demon. And then was executed because did not fulfill the madness of the provocateur. Wami is your minion, the Hikatom, who was <laughs> executed. So that night, uh, the demon would act quiet. He also raised her as the demon, but I choose not to because it doesn't make sense if the demon is dead, why the game is still going on. Oh, actually, I forgot about that. So I should have told Steven something different. But anyway, Jason, you just flew and never used its ability. Lynn is your revenant who was never killed during the night, so it's not relevant. Jen is your demon, the Asmo. Yes, who on the first night chose to kill Candace. On the second night, he may act twice. He chose to act twice. On his first act, he chose uh, two players, Steven and Jason, and his role combination was Undertaker, because apparently Steven had claimed to Jen and Jason as the Almond, uh, and J because Jason claimed perfectly he against uh, Undertaker and Almoner. But that's not correct, so no one died. And then Jane, uh, second 
then he and he choose to do a regular kill and he choose to kill Sarah. Uh, Sarah is your bloodhound. She got only one night information. She picked the clerk who is not in play, so she learned a no. Uh, Candice uh, is a sinner who didn't use her ability and was killed by a regular kill by Jen. Jeremy is a provocateur. On the first night, picked Michael uh, to Matt to execute Jeremy, and then Steven to execute Lynn, and then Steven to execute Jeremy. Chris A is your outsider. He thought he is a confessor, but he's actually the rock. The demon bluff are clerk, urchin, and bailiff. Here's a grimoire. Oh, I never would have got it because I really believe that Jeremy was blighted. <laughs> Jeremy, you knew what I was bluffing as, and you still. I hadn't talked to Jen yet. Okay. No. And he and he did, and then it, if we would have went to sleep, you and uh, Stephen would have died, and that would have just left us with uh, two people left. Yep. Well, the other problem uh, is that uh, I'm pretty sure Jen should have killed me because it says any correct combinations. I don't think he has to get them all right for me to die. No, he explained it to me. I mean, maybe maybe it's written weird, but he explained it to me. I had to get. So I can choose either one person, two people, or three people. If I choose one and choose the guess correct, I'm just killing anyway, so I might as well just kill. Yep. If I'm choosing two, then I have to get both people and both roles for those okay. two people. So um, I was going to go for three because I thought what you thought, which is that if I, as long as I get one of them correct, it doesn't matter. I might as well guess all three, and then if yep. I get it right, awesome. But it, it, he's, it basically, whatever combination, all of them have to be correct. All right. Oh, read. And for the record, I would have picked you, Jen, if you killed me at night. <laughs> That's why I didn't kill you at night. And my plan was to kill uh, Sarah, um, uh, Sarah, Stephen, and Jason, which leaves Lynn, who I've talked to and we kind of had a rapport with, and then um, uh, Chris, and everyone always thinks Chris is sus, so. <laughs> no, 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 I believed Chris. I was gonna, I was hoping that when I nominated Chris, the reason I did is I, he claimed confessor and I was gonna wait for him to say sleuth. I was like, okay, well, you know, Jeremy is the blight and this, so I was gonna confirm Jeremy and Chris and it would have made it look like you regardless, Jen, because Jeremy was so good in making me think he was the blight. I would have totally screwed up my sleuth and been like, Jeremy's the blight and Jen is the, I don't know why, and I would have screwed up, but I would have totally I would have totally been like, Jeremy's the blight, and I'm the sleuth. Well, Guami dying early is really what threw my game, because I really wanted to go at least another round, and then just yeah. knock everyone, because if I could get, and I, again, as soon as me and Jeremy talked, I knew we were the sleuth, so now I had two, so I really yeah. only needed, like, one or two other people, and I knew what halves people were on for the most part, so I could have very easily just started guessing, and if Guami died, like, maybe even one turn later... <laughs> Mm -hmm. two two acts of like guessing everyone just yeah, pretty much we knocks close. yeah Jeremy, knocks played, everyone out you played too good that i believed you the whole game so i would never have picked you i was like i'm never gonna pick jeremy for voting ever i'm with jeremy like you played too good and the fact that i wasn't killed for a longer time and you went along even when you kept saying i don't trust jason jason evil i'm like okay you're you're acting like you maybe don't believe me but i literally said i'm gonna sleuth i'm gonna claim almoner and I'm going to mm -hmm. say that I saw you and you went with it. And I was like, okay, I guess you're good. And I told, I told Michael <laughs> that we did that. Um, and you told Michael that there was a sleuth in play. And I told Michael that we did that. And Michael believed me. And I'm like, okay, this seems to be working. And then I was hoping Chris as a confessor would confirm me if I nominated him. And I was only on Stephen and Jen at that point. I'm like, it's either Stephen or Jen. There's no other people. Well, I got Jen to give me his information. And he was like, I got... Uh, the Undertaker, the Dreamer, and the Sinner. And I'm like, uh, that sounds like crap information. <laughs> well, I gave it to you in order. Night Zero, Sinner. Uh, yeah. Night One, Dreamer. Well, it doesn't matter. Two, Literally, you gave me all the information that was public and or you would have known because I told you. <laughs> it, which is not your fault. I mean, that, you know. Uh, you I, I was going to go yeah. to you and say, I, I figured that I was going to go to you if you died and if you... Anyway, there you have it, in an under an hour, which is pretty, pretty phenomenal. Uh, I feel bad for the evil team. I'm not 100% sure what Jen did the day that, that Guami died. I think that may have been the day that he picked me and Jason. Uh, maybe he picked a regular kill, Sarah, and then, and he was hoping for three kills. Um... 
yeah, the Provocator is a pretty mean uh, character, because not only does it create madness uh, with the result of execution, but it makes good players gun for other players. And I knew that I was the Provocator, and I knew that I had been told to pick Jeremy, which actually made me think that Jeremy was probably good, which he actually wasn't. <laughs> So it's a, it's a pretty mean roll. It does a lot of crap. Uh, I do feel bad for Michael. Uh, I will also say to everybody that was playing the game, it was not super helpful when everybody was like, uh, clearly uh, Stephen has been provocateur. Like I was like, uh, maybe don't say that if you're good. <laughs> um, yeah, but ultimately, uh, well, I didn't have information for... Uh, a couple of people I actually don't know what Chris thought he was, but when Jen gave his information, I was like, okay, that does not feel legit to me. Because he gave me my name, Candace's name, or, or uh, Sinner and Dreamer. And Sinner and Dreamer were both claimed publicly, and I told him. And, you know, it is what it is. Anyway, uh, that is the game. Uh, I think think well i'm playing monday but that is the the third tpi game which those are really super slow is but that one won't go on the channel so i don't know what the next game i'll be playing is probably uh monday so anyway uh, a lot of blood on the clock tower i need to get a bunch of my videos uploaded which the dialogue is kind of disjointed because hmm, by the time i upload this it'll be like two months from now <laughs> But anyway, thanks for watching, and uh, see you next time.